just like past videos, I have my assistant who doesn't do anything. Hey guys, it's Kaz here, okay, Cats and Camera, and today I'm doing my September book haul. So I'm doing things a little bit different this month, I don't know if it's going to work because I've not even looked at all the footage. But basically I've just been unboxing stuff as and when I get it. So there's just going to be a few little clips. Don't worry though, present me also has a lot to get through. So, sending you over to past me in three, two, one. Hey, so I just got in from work and a package has arrived. So I thought I might as well open it on camera. Pow! Yay! So, this is All American Boys by Jason Reynolds and Brendan Keeley. And I won this in a giveaway by McKinley over at McKinley's Bookshelves. I'll leave her link below. She's really awesome, so you should definitely check out her channel. And yeah, she did a, a giveaway for this book and I won it. And it sounds really good. I remember her talking about it in one of her wrap-ups. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. Got one of the cool book depository bookmarks in here. I have two of these bookmarks. But I've never actually bought anything from Book Depository. And now I have three. Always fun to colour. Also, while I'm here, I might as well just throw this one out there as well. I just bought Holes. I finished work. I went into a charity shop. It was 50p. Yeah. By, uh, I'm not sure if it's Louis or Lewis Sacha. But this one is something that a lot of people have already read before. But I've never read it before. So... There's another one. Boom. So I just got another thing through the post. I already know what this is. Offbeat Volume 1. Oh, this is weird. It's not like a proper manga. It's like a book. And it's an old library copy. <laughs> I have quite a few of these old library copy type things because they're cheap on eBay. But yeah, I saw this one on one of the groups I'm in, on Goodreads, they were reading it. And I looked it up and it sounded pretty good. And it was only 1p plus p and p, so I thought, why not pick it up? Another day, another package. Let's try and open this with one hand, it's probably not going to happen. I'm in. I normally always shut the window when I'm filming but you can definitely hear trains so sorry about that but yes I have Young Avengers this is the bind up of the first sort of issuing of it Take this bit of paper out. Yes, they have a more recent edition, but I got this one, complete collection. Damn trains. Well, yeah, I was looking at these, and I was looking at each individual volume was about fifteen pound, even second hand, and then I found the complete set for the same price. So yeah pick this one up and I'm super looking forward to reading this again sorry for how trafficy everything is I really should have shut the window look I have another package and I know what it is and this time I'm actually not going to show my address like every other time I've done this that one is it Yes, I finally got The King's Man. This is the third book in the All For The Men series and I'm so happy to read it. Oh, it's really big. I like the fact that it's bigger than the other two. I actually paid full price for this. I never pay full price for books, but I bought this full price. And I can't wait. And I really wish I wasn't halfway through a book. 
and then also halfway through another review book and then also have another review book I have to review after that but then after that I can get to this so I've got three more packages to open yes I've bought quite a few books I'm gonna start with this one because it's already a bit open at the top it came like that and also there's a book in here that's really thick and I can't remember what it is we shall see ah so the big one is Barracuda I did not realize that this book was so big I saw the mini TV drama thing it was a four-part series it's Australian check it out if you want to so this is Barracuda by Christos Stielskas don't know if I pronounced that right and if I'm correct about this like I say I have actually watched the TV series thing but it's about this kid and it's all about him swimming and becoming better at swimming at school and it's when he was younger but then something happens and he goes to prison or something like that and then it's him quite a while after that I'm really not explaining this very well but I don't want to say too much because obviously I've seen the the drama adaption I don't know how close it actually is to the book so we shall see anyway it seems like something that I would enjoy and the next one in this sort of little package is Sprout by Dale Peck this book is about Sprout who goes to this school and is picked out as being different and not the same as everyone else so he thinks why not go one step further and just dye my hair green and basically this is a coming of age story about a gay kid in a town where there's no place to hide you'll see a theme with these ones I went on a big spree of gay contemporary so you will see a theme next up let's go with this little one this it's got one book in it So this is A Strange and Sudden Thaw by R.W. Day. This one is a sci-fi... I mean, the first the first sentence on the back is Dragons in Virginia. So yeah, you can see where it's headed. But again, this one is also a gay romance, but a sci-fi fantasy as well. So yeah, this one is about two guys, David and Callan, who I'm presuming become an item someplace in this book and basically they have to fight for survival and save their town from these dragons and also the government so I just remember looking on Amazon and it was really expensive and then I checked out eBay and it was quite cheap so yeah I picked that one up sorry if I'm not explaining these very well but I really don't like it when I'm watching a book haul and somebody pretty much tells you the whole plot of the books it's annoying so I like to keep it vague anyway last last package this one's quite heavy I don't know why it's only got two books in but it must be those really dense paperbacks Pow. so as you can probably tell this is two books in the same series this one's the heavy one so which one's the first one I think this is the first one Desert Suns and then the second one into this wonderful wonderful into this world we're thrown by Mark Kendrick I mean these covers are hideous but let's hope that the story inside is better so yeah again as you can probably tell this is a gay contemporary about Scott Faraday's 16 year old kid that's in a rock band from a small town and then of course somebody new moves to town because somebody new always has to move to town and they're always really fun and interesting but Charles a troubled 17 year old moves in and it's about them there we go I only really need to take these covers off because I hate these these are so annoying there we go that's better that's so weird how the second one's so much shorter than the first one anyway I'm just rambling on about stuff that you don't know because I'm not telling you enough about them so those are all the books from this part of the haul again sorry I'm not really telling you much of a synopsis for these 
but I was literally sat there for about an hour going through all the different books. I've got a wish list on Amazon, a private one, that's just gay books. Well, there are a few like over LGBT, but mostly gay. There's like 70 books on there and I was going through all of them, so I don't know a lot about these because I was read so many different synopsises and then I was just picking out the ones that I could find for the cheapest. So yes, sorry about that. I'm sure if you want to hear more about any of these, you can check them out on Goodreads. And here is everything I've picked up this month. Ten things. I don't know how well this video is going to translate. We shall see. I'll probably just end up hauling them properly next month. I don't know. So tell me down below what you picked up in September or if you've read any of these, tell me what you thought about them. If this is your first video by me and you enjoyed it, then please check out some of my others. And if you continue to enjoy them, then please subscribe. That'd be awesome. Anyway, guys, I will see you in a few days with another video. Bye. Oi. All you're doing is being in the way. Keep at it.